I'll keep this very brief. Uh, Brooke Gavin will be on shortly, so I won't spend too long uh, chatting about this fight, but really, really impressive performance by Anthony Joshua. He looked genuinely very, very good indeed tonight. Very good. And credit when it's due. Listen, I'm not an Anthony Joshua hater. Uh, I'm really not. I'd like to see the guy do well as much as the next person. Um, and tonight, perhaps maybe a star is born. He's shown you know, definite improvement. The reason I was so dead against him is um, for the purposes of this fight, I thought Kevin Johnson was so much more of a step up and I wasn't totally sold on the hype. Now, Kevin Johnson, you know, let's be honest, tonight he looked absolutely terrible in there. And that's not taking it away from Anthony Joshua because Johnson came in in better shape. He had been training hard. So the fact that Johnson looked terrible is not actually slagging off Johnson. It's praising Anthony Joshua because AJ made him look terrible. And, you know, as soon as Anthony Joshua turned on the pace, basically, the fight was over. And he showed real power, real sort of killer instinct. And he got rid of a guy who'd went the distance with the likes of Vitaly Klitschko, Fury, Chisora. And, you know, as I say, pretty much Kingpin had no way of dealing with him. I had considered Kevin Johnson a defensively elite fighter, but he had no way whatsoever of dealing with Anthony Joshua. Uh, and Joshua basically steamed through him, you know, long combinations, got him up against the ropes, um, you know, punches to the body, changing levels, really, really impressive performance. So it was, uh, uh, you know, real credit to Anthony Joshua. And um, it's, a, it's a win now. Kevin Johnson's a guy I probably would consider a top 50 heavyweight. Such a dominant performance over Kevin Johnson for me. He does put Anthony Joshua up in sort of top 20, top 25, that sort of territory. Uh, I've already had one or two messages saying who would I like to see him fight next. Possibly someone a bit taller. Um, you know, I, I felt I feel that would be another area of development for him. Um, but we should see, you know, very, very good performance. I'll probably do a more in-detail video tomorrow, but thanks for watching.